Hello everybody. Today we're going to learn how to patch uh, an area, a volume in Fluent using the GUI and the TUI. So the first thing we need to do is to click on initialize. So you can take literally any case. That's not really a big deal here. We can click on initialize. So let's click here and click OK. Once this is initialized, we can click on the patch here. And we see that we can patch literally anything with virtually any expression. We can say, for example, uh, local temperature. We want to address it either on the surface or on the region. The region 1 covers the whole volume. The region 0 covers only a small, small part of the region. We're going to select region 1. We're going to patch it. And we can close, and we can check on our contours. And we can find out here that the contour is so varying from 299.8 uh, Fahrenheit at the uh, Kelvin at the bottom to 300.2 at the top. So this would be a good way to initialize and patch. So to initialize from the TUI, the solution is relatively easy. You can solve initialize init flow, and we can type enter here. And then it's going to initialize the flow at 300 kelvins everywhere. We can see it here. Let's have a look. And here we see the flow is initialized at 300 kelvins everywhere. Now, what we can do is we want to initialize and patch somewhere. So here through the GTY, it's all patch. We can select here the, uh, the domain. Here we have no domain because we're in single phase flow. The region, region zero, which is our local region. And then uh, no additional region, what is the variable we're going to patch, and the temperature. And here, once we, we type enter, it's going to be patched, and we can display again our temperature, and here we're seeing 301 kelvins at this location, which is where our original region zero was, as we can present it here. So in a similar manner, what you can do is you can patch a two-phase two flow or multiple phase flows. So solve and patch are simply the TUI commands, Air, in our case, is one of our phases, but you can use mixture, you can use the other phase, phase one, phase two, etc. Open parenthesis, close parenthesis is simply the cell zone where we want to patch, because in some cases we have multiple cell zones. Then region zero, one, two is the region where we want to patch. Here we want to, region, to patch on region one. Then we want to we open close parenthesis because we do not want to have an additional region. And we can use then the temperature. And of course, we can say that we want to set it at 310 Fahrenheit uh, kelvins. Of course, there is one key here: is you can do it, do this initialization with an expression. Here, for example, we would be able to do gradient as seen here. So here I will do this, and this is provided from this expression here, and we will be able to run it like this, and it's going to mark it. And we can have a look quickly on our on our GUI, and we can find out that a, te a temperature gradient was applied at this location as per the expression given here. All right, so well, thank you very much. And of course, don't forget to give us a like and subscribe for more ANSYS tips and tricks. And if you have any questions or like the content, give us a comment, we'll be more than happy to help you, guide you, and hopefully make your life a bit easier using uh, ANSYS tools. Thank you very much for your time and have a lovely day.